Hey y'all, uh, what I wanted to tell y'all is, uh, what's today's date? Let me see if I got my phone. Yes. It is. What is it? Let me see. Th Tuesday, December the 6th, 6.33 p.m. Alright, so, uh, I really just wanted to come by and tell y'all that the Lord is allowing me to finally see the deep, the true deep meaning of all these dreams I've been having with the December 2012 dream, the December 12, 2012 dream. Uh, they are being set into motion, you know. Um, <clears throat> the sign, uh, what is it, the one with the, the signs, the salvation and the signs in the skies, um, that one right there is talking about the, the three events in the sky. Uh, and they're saying that they just found out about this new planet, like everybody can see it now, you know what I'm saying, where it's been hidden. And they just released it, you know, it was a new, <clears throat> like a new planet or something, you know what I'm saying. And uh, like uh, Nibiru, Nibiru, or however you pronounce it, N-I-B-U-R-U. And uh, and, they, and they, they, they've been knowing about it, you know what I'm saying, because <clears throat> I just heard Bill Cooper in 19, 1983 saying that you know that they had just you know just done this you know and uh hold on. yeah in 1983 they had found out that uh you know that uh, bill cooper said they had just found a new planet and everything and they were releasing it but then they got uh they put a halt the government put a halt to everybody knowing about this new planet and uh and it's been coming and getting closer and it's been gotten into our into our orbit and they're saying that by december i mean they're saying by 2000 like 2012 you know what i'm saying like like it's it's matching up what the scientists are found, finding and what nasa is uh backing uh is finally coming to pass okay so what i was saying is that everything that i've been saying in my dreams and the the uh the three events uh so it's prophetic dream from blake foster uh salvation three three events in the sky uh salvation and three events in the sky that's the exact name of it you know what i'm saying so what i'm saying is these are the uh on youtube these are the, a couple of uh the videos that i saw that that proves what my dreams been saying without me even having the knowledge of these things, you know, and the Lord just giving them to me, you know, and now these things are coming about and people are hearing about them, you know what I'm saying, I said it was three events in the sky, I said it was uh, uh, like a, a moon, like some kind of look like a moon, look like uh, it was the sun, the earth, you know what I'm saying, us, you know what I'm saying, the sun, the sun, uh, the moon, and, and the, uh, the, the, the sun, and you know, and uh, I was looking at it, but it was, you got to check that out, it's prophetic dream, from Blake Foster, um, uh, Salvation and Three Events in the Sky. You have to look at it and see what I'm talking about. And it's the same thing that's matching up with what these people are proving now, are finally coming out and saying and proving. Has, it's been in my dreams from 2008, 2007, you know what I'm saying? The, the stuff that they're proving, saying that they, because they have, no longer can it be dis disputed or, you know, they, they can't say that it's not, that it's not real anymore. They can't say that this planet in between, I said in between us, it was, it was us, it was a planet in between us or some kind of moon looking thing, and it was a, uh, and, and it was like the sun. There was three events in the sky and they lined up straight, and that's what was going on. Look how many jeans I got. Jerry's. Hmm? Daddy, Daddy, look, look how many jeans I got. How many? 100. 100. Wow. Come over here. Come over here for a minute. Let's keep coming. Because, look. I, I got 100. Right there. Hmm. I'm going to teach them how to mm -hmm. play. Everyone, this is how you play. This, these are the, this is home, games, videos, play. Books. Yeah, so everything that I've described and I kept telling you. And Dola, Dola and Diego, and it's, this is what... So everything that I told y'all is come, you know, is coming to pass. Everything. Uh, what else? Let me think of some more. Uh, the December 12, 2012, signs in the sky. That's a future event. 
uh, that had to do with the, the sun, you know what I'm saying? Oh, actually, uh, the moon uh, shaking, turning blood red. Uh, like I said, the uh, salvation and three events in the sky. It was um, that was that was the three events in the sky where it lined up straight. This is exactly what they're pre what they're saying now. What the scientists what the scientists are confirming, you know, what I'm saying are, are saying and delivering the message that this is what's going on. Everything that was in my that's been in my dreams has been that it has been predicted. Everything that has been predicted uh, by my Lord Jesus Christ is. Is happening, and that's what I'm saying. When are y'all gonna When are y'all gonna catch on to this? Because obviously that means something. If, if I've been having them since 2008, they hadn't even released the information until 2008. You know what I'm saying? This stuff is groundbreaking. Nobody just can, they they just y'all just haven't caught on to it. I pray in Jesus' name that people catch on to this and see that my dreams. Go look at them. Uh, so we got. Uh, these signs in the sky, December 12th. Prophetic dream from Blake Foster. Signs in the sky. Uh, December 12, 2012. Uh, what else? What's some other? Uh, let me see. Um, I got another one. Another dream about uh, December 12, 2012. That's another scenario, you know, that the Lord been giving me. All of these and all of the people know that the end of the world is coming. They can see it on the news. It's starting. All, all this stuff is prophecy, y'all. Y'all got to see it. It's all prophecy. Everything. Just go look. At the video, you can you got the access, you got the brain, the capabilities. God can bless you just like this. Go look at my old stuff. You know what I'm saying? Look at my old stuff. Look at these dreams I'm telling you to look at about the the, the December 12, 2012 dreams. Another dream about uh, another dream about the December 12, 2012 uh, prophetic dream. Signs in the sky, December 12, 2012. Um, like I said, uh, salvation and three events in the sky. Uh, you know what I'm saying? And uh, also, not only that, the one where it said uh, prophetic dream from Blake Foster, the beginning of the uh, the system of things has changed. The beginning of the end has begun. Began. Uh, that one, you know, and that's like that's four parts. You know what I'm saying? And then, uh, like I said, I had it was the earthquake. You know what I'm saying? The earthquake was the first thing to set this off after I had the dream. Eleven days later, a massive earthquake. And then these earthquakes did not stop. But I said, this is what's in Matthew chapter 24. This is what is going on, you know, and this is being fulfilled. And it's being fulfilled to the fullest. And now I want all of y'all to understand who I am for the Lord. I want y'all to understand that I serve Jesus Christ and I'm here obviously to lead y'all because I've been telling y'all since the beginning I've been the watchman I haven't been silent and I've been telling y'all from the beginning since you know I've been you know documenting this stuff in like 2006 2007 but you know what I'm saying uh, I've given I've been giving all of it to, I, mean, I still have so much to give to y'all you know but look what I'm giving and look look at look at it it's it's, it's proven up it's matching up uh the other one is uh Will the earthquakes? Pro let me see. Prophetic dream from Blake from Blake Foster. Will the earthquakes get better? And you know my an like I said, my answer in there was no. You know what I'm saying this is prophesied. And have they got better? No, they have not. I'm not a scientist, y'all. I didn't go to school for this. God has given me this gift to give to y'all. You know what I'm saying, and I'm giving it. And, and in that dream, it said that it was a uh, the, the holy the uh, it was a hole. In the uh, in the ozone layer, you know what I'm saying? It was a uh, like like it was messing up. It was destroying the ozone layer because all the carbon dioxide was be was uh, trapping in all this heat in the in the earth, and it was uh, messing up the ozone layer. You know what I'm saying? And uh, it's causing glo global warming. You know what I'm saying? And now I'm just now today, like I said, just caught on to some new some new stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like I say, Bill Cooper, Bill Cooper, he hit me up. You know what I'm saying with the uh, Planet X, Nibiru, Hoax, Bill Cooper. This is all this on YouTube. NASA found Planet X in 1983. Planet X, what they telling y'all about now, you know, on the news and all that, is it wasn't found in 1983. Uh, let's see. Between the, the Earth and the Sun, just like my dream, just like, just like prophetic dream, uh, salvation, and the three events in the sky. Uh, let's see, and this was from. Let me see. I get the Planet X Nibiru spotted by NASA, uh, July 2011. Amazing proof. 
and this is by Daily News Messenger One, and this is on um, YouTube. And uh, like I said, I mean, look, this is what I'm saying. All my, all the things that's been that was prophecy. It's like basically what I'm saying is all my prophecies are coming true. That Lord, that the Lord has given me, are coming true about these things, and that's what I want y'all to understand and realize. So you know, so y'all can follow the truth. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, I'm telling the truth, and it ain't even me. It's just a gift that Lord wants y'all to know. So he's telling it through me, and I'm giving it to y'all. Now y'all seeing that everything that I'm saying is lining up even with scientific. You know what I'm saying? They can't lie about it no more. They can't hide it no more because even the common folk, you know what I'm saying, any kind of ast astronomer or person who, uh, you know, gazes upon the stars, they will be able to, with the technology we have, be able to see this Nibiru now. You know what I'm saying? That's in between, you know, that's... Uh, in our in our galaxy now, you know what I'm saying? Which what was what was which is what was predicted, you know what I'm saying? And when they when we line up, it's gonna be it's gonna be catastrophic, you know what I'm saying? Just as predict what's predicted when the seven tri tri seven year tribulation comes, and we're supposed to be Christians who believe in Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior are supposed to be saved from this, you know? Those who believe in Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior are supposed to be saved from this. So you have to understand. So this is what these are the things that I've seen today. So uh, NASA warns be prepared. And this is uh, on YouTube also. T-Y, and this is by T-Y-L-O-R-N-E. And uh, you know what I'm saying? And then I had another one then I, that I found today because God is just giving me all this information today. You know what I'm saying? So I'm giving it to y'all. Uh, conspiracy Theory with Jesse Ventura. Apocalypse Apocalypse 2012 by Anti Disinfo. Uh, that's uh, A N T I D I S I N F O. Uh, I think that's right. I th well, I think that I might mess it up. But it's, uh, yeah, so that's who it's by. And uh, uh, it's talking about, you know, saying these, these people's evil people's plots, you know what I'm saying? And, the government in high places, what they're planning to do, you know, they're planning to preserve themselves while they know that this catastrophe is coming. See, I've been predicting, I've been telling y'all, I mean, through the Lord, my Lord Jesus, in Jesus' name, I've been telling y'all from, you know, at least 2008 documented on camera that the system of things has changed, the beginning of the end has begun. And what does that describe? Matthew chapter 24, Luke chapter 21, Luke chapter 17, Mark chapter 13. Uh, Acts chapter 2, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, it's, it's, it's the beginning of the end. It's not the end. See, he said these are only the sorrows to come. Hold on. Yeah, man, so all this stuff is only proving me right, man, that, that what the Lord is saying through me, it's what he's showing me in my dreams at night, you know, when he when a man falls in the deep sleep, Job chapter 33, man falls in the deep sleep, God comes, speak to him, opens his ear, and inclines and gives him the things that he needs in order to survive and, and not and not go into uh, the the river of death, you know what I'm saying? Keep him away from that. Uh, keep him from the evil one. Keep him on the straight path and give him in the, him his, his instructions on what he is to do for the Lord, because that's what you live for. You live for the Lord. So that's when when so when people saying that dreams don't come from God, well. And then you going against God's word that say that Job chapter thirty three. Now we know that this devil is the the devil does inspire dreams also, you know. And uh, you got to watch out for those, but you got to ask for the spirit of discernment. Uh, here is Philip. Yeah. So Matthew chapter twenty four. You know what I'm saying. Look at the uh, beginning of the end prophecy fulfilled. You know what I'm saying. I, look at that too. You know what I'm saying. Just how I felt. You know when I seen. You know May third. I had a dream about. You know the the beginning of the system change. Uh, the beginning of the, the system changing. Uh, the, the beginning of the end beginning. You know what I'm saying? And then you know that's what this Matthew chapter 24 says. He says Jesus told them now because this is what Jesus foretells the future. As Jesus was leaving the temple grounds, his his disciples pointed to him that the various temple buildings. But he told them, Do you see all these buildings? I assure you, they will be so completely demolished that not one stone will be left on top of another. Later, Jesus sat on the slopes of Mount...